Welcome to this technical corner. Today I'm joined by Mike Harris from Bison UK and we're going to be discussing the Vice 6620. 6620, yes, this is our modular Vice. Modular, so give us a brief overview, Mike. Please. When we say modular, it means you could unbolt this, turn it around, put this on here. You can change the jaws around from conventional jaws, from drawdown jaws. You can move this around. That's the, that's the phrasing of modular. But this is our most popular vice by Mark. So this vice from Bison, where is it manufactured? Poland, in our factory in Poland. Perfect. Now, when you say um, pull down jaws, explain how these work. Pull down jaws, as you can see on here with the angle. Most conventional vices will have just straight parallel jaws and then you clamp as normal, you torque up. But in essence, what that's doing is pushing the workpiece up. It's very slightly, not to the eye. With Draw down jaws, the more pressure you put on this, the more you clamp, it will push the component down, which is what you need. And what kind of box. clamping force are you looking to get? I think you by using a torque wrench, you get optimum clamping force. Capacity, working capacity? Capacity, we do these in eight different sizes, which means you can go from 100 millimeters jaw width up to 200. You can go from capacity wise, naught up to 360 out here capacity millimeters. Now you mentioned um, a reversible fixture. Why would you Why would you use a reversible fixture? I think if it's just a very rough billet that you want to introduce before you do some initial machining to get it all squared up, you could turn this around as you see by the uh, etchings on here and the markings, you can use that for early cut work. Okay, and you can introduce soft jaws? Soft jaws, there's lots of different types of jaws you can have for this. So you can always mill a sort of lip on there or something. You can use these with parallels. I see tap tiles in there, so I'm assuming it's to, to, to bolt jaws on. Now you've also got tap tiles on the, the outside. What's that for? Workpiece, workpiece stops on either side. The, okay. uh, if you want to put it on a bed, there's the holes down the front here in the body. If you're clamping in multiples, but if you're just doing it on its own, we have normal clamps that are supplied. This is to bolt the actual vice to the machine bed? To the bed. machine bed, yes. Okay, if, and is, is, is the base of the vice being ground? So say yes. for exa example, you wanted to mount a component across multiple yep. vices. How, how accurately have they been ground to? Uh, 0 0.02. And hardened? Hardened ground, body all over. Okay. Sounds very impressive, uh, Mike. So now finally, just show me how that moving jaw works. It's just a tilt mechanism. Move it up, you can pull it back. So here, that's it. When you're clamping, there's dimples on here. So you just locate with this and then use the crank to clamp. So eight different sizes, modular aspects to this vise, hard jaws, soft jaws, pull down force. Mark Harris, thank you very much. If people want to get in touch, how should they get in touch? Speak to Bison UK Limited.